Welcome back. To Welcome back to the How to Belly Dance Online channel. I'm your host today. I'm glad you're back. Just joking. Okay, okay. We're gonna be working on the Ummy and it's gonna be super fun. And it's kind of a scary move for me. So don't critique me too hard. Let's get going on that. All right, so the Ummy is going to start off with a hip circle. If you don't know what I'm talking about, a hip circle, if that sounds a little bit confusing, check out this video. It is all about hip circles and that'll help you out. Hip circle. We're going to start with hitting four different points with our hips. So starting in our belly dance position, feet are shoulder width apart, knees are bent, arms are up and back, pelvis is tucked, and we're going to start with a right hip slide. So we're sliding our hip to the right. Our center of gravity is still in the center and we're consisting or we're getting this move by just bending our knees. Okay. So we're at the right side. Now we're going to hit a front point and that is just shifting the weight over the front side of our center of gravity. Does that make sense? Good. Our pelvis is still tucked in this move. Okay, and our knees are still bent. We're gonna move this to the left side, which is a nice same sister move to the right side. Knees are still bent and shifting it all the way to the back. This, our, our pelvis is still tucked in this back move and our knees are still bent as well. Okay, we're just gonna start going to the right, going to the front, and then going to the left, and we're just gonna start working on this hip circle for a little bit, okay? Hitting our right point, front point, left point, back point, right point, front point, back point, left point. Let's smooth it out. Right, forward, left, back. Right, forward, left, back. There you go, not too confusing. That was a hip circle. We do have to do it on the left side, so don't get scared. So, left point, front point, right point, back, left, front, right, back. Let's smooth it out. Right, left, front, right, back, and left, front, right, back. All right, so we completed our hip circles to the right and hip circles to the left. Our next move that we're gonna work on is a pelvis tuck and release. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn this way so that you can see my pelvis and see how much I am tucking. Okay, so in our belly dance position, we are still, knees are still bent, dropping us about an inch lower than we normally are. I'm gonna put my hands back here so you can still see what we're doing. But our pelvis uh, lift and tuck is pretty much just that. Our hips are going to be shifting forward and back. And that's just getting accomplished with a tilt move of our hips or a pelvis. Okay, so pelvis is gonna be tucked. Our stomach, lower stomach is contracted and present, holding that position and the release is just releasing that lower muscle and then releasing that back pelvis tuck, okay? That's the release and the tuck. Release, tuck. Now girls, don't get too crazy with this one, okay? So, release, tuck. Release, tuck. Don't worry about holding the stomach in. I know that you, you wanna kinda hold it in to make it look pretty. Relax the stomach muscles. Relax, relax, relax. Okay, so now you kind of have the feeling of tilting your pelvis forward and backward. Our next move that we're gonna work on is a hip lift. So how we're gonna do that, we're in our belly dance position. Our center of gravity is in the center and we're going to contract our oblique muscle on the right side and we're gonna bend our left knee and straighten our right slowly, not all the way. It's still gonna be bent, softly bent. 
but our left knee is gonna be way more bent than our right, and that's gonna give us that hip lift move. Okay, so to achieve the left side, we're gonna do the same thing, just bending that right leg and straightening this left leg. Okay, so now we have the left hip lift. Okay, so we're gonna shift the weight, do the same thing to the right side. We're getting this all by just bending our knees and to the left side. Right and the left. Let's speed it up a little bit. Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Notice I'm keeping my heels on the ground for this move. I'm not getting that lift movement by lifting up my heels. They are firmly planted on the ground. Right, left. Okay, so the ami consists of a hip circle, hip slides, hip lifts, and it's kind of all combined together. So if you can visualize your hips sitting in a bowl, they're gonna be rolling around as if they're pivoting on this access point at the bottom. So it's just gonna be going right, right. Will it spill out? Whoa, well, I don't know. Okay, so that's what we're gonna be doing with our hips. Okay, so in our belly dance position, we're gonna hit the right hip lift. Okay, are we in the hip right, right hip lift? Okay, our next move is going to be a pelvis tuck forward. So we're gonna shift that. So see how I'm, my pelvis is tucked? I'm in that pelvis tuck position. Okay, now I'm just going to move it to the left side for a left hip lift. Okay, and the last move to finish out the ami, I'm going to push it out and relax, releasing that pelvis to, a, to that um, backward move, okay? So, right side, right hip lift, pelvic tuck, left, left hip lift, pelvis release, right lift, pelvis tuck, left lift, pelvis release. So if we're gonna smooth this around, it'll look something like this from that side angle. Tuck, left, release. Right, tuck, left, release. Oh my goodness, you're doing an ummy. Let's try it on the left side. Everyone has a slide that's much better. My, my side that's better is definitely the right, so I'm a little hesitant to show you my left, but we gotta do it, we gotta balance it out. So, left side, we're gonna do a left hip lift, left, pelvis tuck, right hip lift, pelvis release, left hip lift, pelvis tuck, right hip lift, pelvis release. Let's smooth it out. Forward, right, left. I'm sorry, back, left, forward, right, back. Okay, I think you guys are ready for some music. Let's start playing with this ummy. Maybe do a few variations of it with the rhythm of the music. Yeah, let's do it. Let's position our feet are shoulder width apart. For this song, we're just gonna have our hands rested low B, okay? Focusing on that hip. Don't get too close to the hips. We need space, okay? Good music. Five, six, starting with the right. Right, forward, left, release. Right, forward, left, release. Right, forward, left. Let's smooth it out. Right, forward, still slow, left, release, right, forward, left, release, let's speed it up a little bit, right, right, forward, left, release, right, forward, left, release, there you go, right, forward, left, release, right, forward, left, let's switch to left, left, forward, right, release, left, forward, right, 
release. Left. Forward. Let's speed it. Up. Left. Forward. Right. Release. Left. Forward. Right. Release. Left. Forward. Right. Release. Let's smooth it out. And left. Release. Left. Forward. Right. Release. Forward. Right. Release. Let's speed this up, okay? Let's see what happens. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Left, 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 left. Let's switch to the right side. Right, right, left, back, right, forward, left, back. Let's speed this one up, okay? Right, forward, left, back. Right, forward, left, back. Right, forward, left, back. Right, forward, left, back. Again, I'm getting all of this movement in our knees. Right, forward, left, back. Right, forward, left, back. Let's switch it up, okay? Right, forward, left, back. Left, forward, right, back. Right, forward, left, back. Left, forward, right, back. We're just doing a little mirror of this move together. Back to normal. Right, forward, left, release. Right, forward, left, release. All right, well done. Again, if you're not happy with this move yet, that's okay, it's gonna take a little bit. Keep practicing. Watch this video as many times as you need to. Also, those videos I talked about, those will also help you break down those individual moves that make up this fun move. Thanks again for watching, you guys. If you liked what you saw, subscribe, hit the like button, and comment any questions you have below. We'll see you next.